NewView equipment is designed to last for years of useful service. Careful consideration is given in selecting components for durability, performance, and ease of maintenance. While NewView equipment is designed for minimum care and maintenance, certain steps are required by the user for maximum equipment life and effectiveness. These steps include proper installation of equipment, correct application and usage of the equipment, dry out procedures performed daily, and thorough cleaning on a regular basis. In this video, we will be going over daily, weekly, monthly, and yearly maintenance procedures. Your unit should be cleaned daily and as soon as possible after a spill has occurred. It is essential to maintain a clean unit, especially if the public views the unit in your place of business. The following should be used for cleaning. The oven and proofer interiors should be cleaned on a regular basis with mild soap and hot water, followed by a thorough rinse with fresh clean water. The stainless steel exterior may be cleaned with any good stainless steel cleaner or polish or with hot soapy water followed by a clear rinse if it is very soiled. All glass should be cleaned with a glass cleaning formula. Baked on or excessive soiling can be removed with soap and hot water, followed by a thorough rinse with fresh clean water. Make sure to clean both the interior and exterior of all glass surfaces. NewView warns against using oven cleaners in the oven. Once inside the walls, these cleaners are very difficult to remove and may cause your oven to smoke or emit noxious fumes until they are rinsed out or burned away. You will need to completely disassemble the oven interior in order to flush away any remaining cleaner. For your proofer dry out procedure, first wipe out any standing water in the bottom of the proofer. Next, empty, clean, and replace the drain pan beneath the proofer. Next, set the proofer power switch to on. Leave the temperature control at its normal setting and turn the humidity dial to the off setting. Leave the proofer door open by about one to two inches and allow the proofer to run for about 30 minutes or until it is dried out. Once your proofer dryer procedure is finished, turn the proofer power switch to off. Leave the proofer door slightly open overnight or until ready to use the next time. For the oven dry out procedure, set the oven power switch to off. Leaving the door open about one to two inches is enough for the residual baking heat to dry out the moisture that may be trapped in the insulation or other components of the oven.
clean the water pan. First, ensure that the proofer is off prior to cleaning the water pan. Water pan and water inside of it may still be hot. Allow water pan to cool before attempting to remove. First, open proofer door. Lift the right side wall approximately one half inch and swing towards the center of the cavity to access the element cover and water pan. Remove the water pan and clean the scale buildup from both the pan and the element with approved cleaner. New View approves of using clear white distilled vinegar for your descaling needs. Fill your water pan with half water and half white vinegar. Replace into its holding element and allow to sit overnight. Either after a few hours or in the morning, remove your water vinegar solution from your pan. Wipe down the element and your float with the vinegar water solution as well. Replace your pan and you're ready to proof.